Hi guys, in this video I'll show you how to grease your front end with the grease gun. So this is a 2001 Ford Escape customer's car. This, whenever you see, this is actually the stabilizer link over here and this is a little ball joint in here. Um, usually when you see Zerk fittings like these, that means you could grease them. Uh, sometimes they don't have and they're sealed so you don't have to grease those now when you grease these you need a grease gun obviously and you put the you clean the zerk fitting and you put the actual tip of the gun in there until you hear a click and I have blue grease in here so once I see blue grease oozing out of the sleeve over here that means it's fully greased now if you're creaking or a little crackling sometimes, it could be because of this stuff. So let me show you, let me start pumping away here. And the best thing is to actually hold it in place. So let me see if I could actually... What I'm going to do, I'm just going to press it in there and make sure, because now it's coming off the side, and make sure it's coming out of here. So let me just put you down, I'll grease it up a little bit, and I'll give back to you guys sorry for the bad video and you hear a bubble sometimes pull the zip fitting out so basically it looks like this that's what it looks like once you're done. Um, I overdid it here just to exaggerate so to show you guys how when it leaks out what it looks like. And you're going to want to see the blue come out also. That means it's all fully greased up in there. So go around. Sometimes the tie rods that have these for older vehicles and whatnot. And uh, I would do this every maybe second or third oil change. It doesn't matter. The more you grease them, the better. So thanks for watching and check out my channel and subscribe. Also, check out NewYorkThirdGen.com. It's N-Y-T-H-I-R-D-G-E-N.com for some of the fastest cars in New York. Thanks and take care.